In this video, we are going to take an example from trigonometry. If A is an acute angle and sine A is 3 by 5, find all the other trigonometric ratios of angle A using trigonometric identities. Now we have been given sine A is equal to 3 by 5. So let us write step number 1. Sine A is equal to 3 by 5. Now with the help of sine A we could easily obtain cos A. Now we know the relation that cos square A plus sine square A is equal to 1. So therefore we have cos square A is equal to 1 minus sine square A. Now we substitute the value of sine A in this equation. So we obtain cos square A is equal to 1 minus 3 by 5 the whole square. Now 3 by 5 the whole square gives us 9 by 25. So we have cos square A is equal to 1 minus 9 by 25. Now equalizing the denominator we get cos square A is equal to here we have 25 minus 9 divided by 25. So we have cos square A is equal to 16 by 25. Now if we take the square root we obtain cos A equal to 4 by 5. So we have sin A equal to 3 by 5 and cos A is equal to 4 by 5. Now we could easily obtain the remaining ratios. So we could easily obtain tan A. Now tan A could be expressed as sin A upon cos A. Now sin A is 3 by 5 cos A is 4 by 5. We cancel out the 5's and we get the answer as 3 by 4. Next, with the help of sin A, we could easily obtain cosec A. Now, cosec A is nothing but reciprocal of sin A. That is 1 over sin A. So, we have now reciprocal of sin A. Sin A is 3 by 5. So, cosec A would be 5 by 3. Similarly, sec A, this is nothing but reciprocal of cos A. Now, the value for cos A is 4 by 5, so its reciprocal would be 5 by 4. And lastly, we could easily obtain cot A. Now, cot A is nothing but 1 over tan A that is reciprocal of tan A. Now the value for tan A is 3 by 4 so cot A would be 4 by 3. 